Very good morning children. Today we are going to discuss about human physiology. So you all know some 15 to 16 questions appears from this unit human physiology. The very first chapter in human physiology is digestion and absorption. And it deals about food. We all like food, isn't it or not? So tell me what's your favorite food? Yeah, you like puri and you like dosa. Very good. So these dosa and puri consists of what? Of course, nutrition or nutrients. So what are those nutrients? It consists of protein, carbohydrate, fat and little quantity of vitamins, minerals and also water. Children, they may ask you among these nutrients which may prevent dehydration and helps in metabolic activity. Of course, very correct. It is water which prevents dehydration and also helps in metabolic activity. And what are other nutrients performed? Of course. So when you are born, you are a small baby, yes or not? So now you are grown up, an adolescent boy and a girl. That is because of your nutrient. So it help us to grow. When we fell down, we get wound, yes or not? And then later on, after a week, it get repaired. A tissue repair is because of our nutrient. The tissue repair is even called as rejuvenation. Of course, energy. So these things we are obtaining only from our food. Okay, fine. This nutrition involves five major steps. So what are those five major steps? Ingestion, digestion, absorption, assimilation and egation. Okay, shall we see the children? into simpler ones. Of course, with the help of enzymes and also mechanical means. Absorption. So we suck in the nutrient with the help of our delay in small intestine. That is absorption. Assimilation. Where the cellular constituents are formed from the nutrients and reserved is what we call it as assimilation. Finally, egation. Where the waste materials are egated out with the help of our anus. Send out. Through anus. Okay. Do you know children, our digestive system consists of what? Digestive system consists of alimentary canal and associated organs. So what may be the length of our digestive system? This alimentary canal includes from mouth to anus and which is only around 5 to 7 meter long. Only this alimentary canal will do our digestive system. 
system? Of course, no. It also includes some associated organs. So what are those associated organs? They are like liver, pancreas. Okay. So this is about our digestive system. In upcoming videos, we are going to discuss all these in detail. Can I stop this video with a small question, children? Yeah. Can you tell me why herbivores are having longer alimentary canal compared to a lion like a carnivore? Can you post your answers in the comment box? Please subscribe and support us. Thank you all for watching.